uh, and hello again, guys. Uh, what about my presentation? It will be, well, I will switch to next uh, slide. And uh, today I will um, present only uh, startups uh, in which I was uh, working or which uh, I helped create uh, or which I uh, move to success. And um, what will be? Not no coding. Today uh, we will speak uh, not about coding, but uh, only uh, about architecture, about using uh, Python with different languages, uh, with different uh, architectures like uh, IMR like uh, x86 uh, x64 uh, etc uh, today we will speak about different communication protocols different ideas and uh, uh, where and how uh, we can use uh, python we will talk about uh, hardware uh, hard hardware uh, how we uh, uh, can uh, choose uh, hardware to each startup or each propose about uh, different uh, about open source yeah open source and startup um, I say that it, we must have open source in, in startup and mostly uh, success succeed project uh, use open source uh, and uh, rewrite open source or in time uh, move uh, their project to open source. Um, okay, uh, what is startup? Startup is, uh, let's say, idea. Uh, idea of something new, uh, idea of new, idea of new idea, on new product, it, it could be new product, it could be new uh, algorithm, it could be anything what you imagine. Uh, we even uh, can say that uh, if you have uh, your uh, home pet uh, dog, uh, it could be your startup to create the similar dog. <laughs> yeah. yeah, strange, but uh, it's uh, also a lot of startups on market, how to create pets, uh, how to biologically make them uh, similar uh, how to clone, et cetera. We, we can uh, speak about startups in uh, everywhere. And uh, today I will present uh, seven, uh, seven different startups and uh, each startup uh, uh, was, uh, uh, modif uh, let's say, was created or was connected by, uh, by Lviv IT industry by uh, Lviv Python Society, etc. Okay, let's begin. Once upon a time in, in a galaxy far, far away, you know this, uh, 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 oh, I forget what it was movie, it was movie Star Wars, yeah. Let's go. Uh, what is startup? Startups uh, are business uh, that want to uh, disrupt industries and change the world and do it uh, at all scales. Startups founder uh, dream to giving social uh, to something uh, in needs but hasn't created yet. Generating eye popping uh, valuation at lead and uh, initial public offering. Uh, what is IPO? Uh, I will uh, tell you about this small thing, small thing IPO. Every startup, uh, when you create something new, you need money, yeah? Uh, you have idea, you need uh, money for this idea, you need money for food, you need money for uh, paying uh, salary. And the most uh, startup on market, uh, all, most of um, startup owners have no money. Let's say 99% of startup owners have no money to uh, their idea. That's why they try to reach uh, startup incubators, uh, startup uh, hubs, uh, what is startup incubators or hub? This is an uh, IPO company that give you money, uh, give you money for your startup, but uh, 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 they took uh, part of your business. Uh, how it look uh, like? Um, they give you, let's say, in the beginning, 1,000 
100,000 uh, of dollars and uh, you give uh, them uh, half of your business, but you will pay only, uh, um, uh, only if your business, if your idea will be successful. It means IPO, Initial Public Offering. And uh, if we will speak about uh, Hacks Hub, uh, it's one of the biggest uh, hub in the world. Uh, 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 each startup, uh, uh, once per year, uh, uh, could um, uh, offer uh, we, um, uh, IPO owners could offer to startup uh, each year. Uh, some money, more money for your business. Uh, first, uh, in the beginning, you got uh, hundred thousand of dollars for your startup, for your growing. After a year, you can uh, get million. After two years, you can go uh, get ten millions of dollars, and so on, and so on, and so on, and so on. But uh, if you uh, reach a uh, goal one million or bigger then your startup start of working and uh, make money. And uh, this is interesting. Okay, I uh, told you about what is startup and for, for what it, uh, what it means. And next we will go to startups. First of all, uh, uh, it was uh, uh, five years ago, I work in a startup, it was, company uh, uh, red Ukrainian company uh, that uh, in uh, some time when company grow out uh, grow uh, they uh, make rebranding and this company known uh, as uh, Serara technologies uh, what was the idea uh, of startup uh, they uh, built uh, self checkout uh, equipment uh, for markets now you can go to Aushan uh, or you can uh, go to a center and see uh, self checkout uh, in the supermarket. But uh, five years ago, in uh, uh, Ukrainian market, in uh, East Europe, uh, in Middle East, in a a Asia market, uh, was no any equipment for this purpose. Uh, such companies, uh, uh, European companies like. Uh, uh, BCR, like, uh, oh, I, forget, I, I forget it, I forget it. Uh, it uh, uh, IBM also makes self checkout self systems. Uh, it it uh, on a uh, uh, global market, on all, all of the globe, we have only uh, three big uh, monitors of this equipment. And this equipment is really expensive. Uh, guys from China, from India, trying to make uh, their own solution, but uh, this solution was uh, um, a really bad quality, uh, quality uh, bad integration to customer system, bad support, you know, what is chi uh, chi China device. Now I return to uh, this startup. Uh, idea was uh, to create uh, e Easy construct, easy modified, uh, low expensive systems that could be uh, easily integrated with third party uh, equipment, uh, with uh, um, different custom uh, customer networks and ecosystem. Uh, it could be uh, customized as any you want. Uh, uh, this was main goal. And uh, I and my team spent probably more than three years to building these uh, devices. And uh, okay, let, let's look at um, other uh, slide, how it works. On previous slide, you see a pretty nice uh, picture. Uh, but uh, in effect, uh, this equipment uh, uh, was divided to two different systems. One system, it uh, was this uh, screen, what you see, uh, this screen with user interface, uh, we connect to this, uh, uh, what we connect, I, I will talk uh, in the next slide. Uh, this uh, screen, what, what we see. Uh, in effect, uh, this is a Linux-based uh, mini computer. 
uh, inside this uh, mini computer work uh, uh, Python uh, backend. Uh, you, uh, on UI, you can use uh, Python, you can use Qt, you can use React, Angular, or anything what you want to create a user interface. And to this uh, screen, we connect uh, equipment such as uh, printers, uh, bank terminals, uh, uh, simple equi equipment, just what we need to uh, uh, user interface uh, uh, with uh, client. Second computer, uh, which was called uh, Black Box, was in, uh, inside uh, this uh, box with equipment uh, in, inside the uh, metal box. And uh, these two computers uh, was connected uh, together uh, using uh, internal networking, uh, two devices with internal networking. To black box, we uh, connect uh, equipment such as scales, scanners, uh, any scanners from uh, market. Uh, also bl uh, black box computer, uh, uh, have its own model uh, with networking, uh, uh, it works like a switch, like hub, uh, like uh, standalone system. Uh, um, also, uh, we use uh, this black box computer for cash management, advertisement, connection to other equipment. Uh, that's why uh, uh, it was a big problem because um, we have a lot of different equipment. Uh, each equipment have um, its own um, uh, its own uh, libraries, artists, languages, anything, protocols, sports. That's why on Black Box it was uh, its own API inside here. API was uh, driving by Flask or Falcon, no matter. We use uh, uh, micro framework for this purpose. And uh, uh, this uh, on this micro service, uh, uh, we communicate with all equipment and create a standardized artist, uh, standardized artist and party integration, database, internal database, uh, logging, etc. Uh, let's look uh, next slide. Uh, how it worked, how it worked Redbox, this computer. Uh, inside this uh, computer was uh, Python also with Flask Falcon, also Python model uh, with uh, this microservice uh, com uh, was um, communication between the UI. UI was uh, on the beginning, it was uh, written by Python, uh, and uh, after that, after a branding, uh, we use React or Angular uh, uh, services, and uh, it uh, was um, really good look, like um, pre pretty look. Uh, also, what we connect, uh, we connect to uh, Redbox bank terminals. Uh, what interesting is bank terminals? Uh, all bank terminals in Ukraine uh, on that time was delivered with uh, C, uh, C++ or uh, Java libraries. Uh, that means that you have no direct uh, connection or direct um, speaking with bank terminal. You use only uh, this uh, uh, libraries and speak only with this uh, libraries and each command must be uh, in each place. Uh, in other countries, if we look to uh, Kuwait, to Middle East, uh, etc., uh, their bank terminals uh, could, uh, could be delivered to you, uh, to developer, uh, with uh, closed code. That means that you cannot uh, access to libraries, you have only uh, application, uh, um, like, like similar application, press one, uh, type uh, some, press two, 
type uh, second sum, press enter, like uh, um, it works like on how to describe, uh, like uh, personal calcul calculator on your PC. You just press uh, uh, buttons and enter. The same, uh, I don't know why, but the same terminals, uh, very phone, uh, or uh, other manufacturers in the Middle East, uh, all uh, connection to these terminals are closed. That's why uh, we also use Python, because Python uh, we can use to uh, connect uh, other languages. And also inside Python, we could uh, uh, grab a uh, um, uh, terminal output. We, we, we could uh, simulate the, um, the terminal output and speak directly uh, with bank terminal. In the European Union, the, the same bank terminal, uh, they are. Uh, uh, protocol uh, are uh, public uh, uh, accessible and you could uh, write your own uh, python library or uh, even found this library in github in the open source uh, this <laughs> what, what's strange is three different uh, market and three different uh, type of integration the same equipment uh, yeah what all also interesting with uh, bank terminals, uh, we have uh, two manufacturers of bank, bank terminals. This is Verifone uh, Corporation and uh, Ingenico Corporation. And in fact, uh, they provide uh, uh, blank terminals. This is device without any source code inside. That's why every country, uh, every bank uh, creates their own uh, 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 application that uh, upload to terminal uh, and that's why the uh, uh, speaking protocols uh, in different banks uh, could be uh, really uh, really uh, hard to integrate yeah i, I could uh, uh, tell you about uh, bank terminals a lot of uh, tales but but let, let it be let it be Okay, uh, let's look uh, to printers. Uh, in uh, every country, we have uh, the same problem with printers. It can be a receipt printer, uh, it can be tax re registrator, it could be smart receipt. What is a uh, receipt printer? It's just, just a printer which we connected to CAPS system and we just sa uh, say Python, hey, Python, print it. And, and that's all. This regular receipt printer that you can, uh, could uh, see in a supermarket uh, everywhere. But what interesting, uh, in Ukraine exists a uh, tax re uh, registrator. It's a printer, uh, receipt printer, which connected to internet and directly sent uh, receipt data uh, to our uh, tax system. Uh, you can notice it that uh, if you go to cafe, uh, sometimes you got um, uh, barcode on your uh, or QR code on your um, uh, receipt. This means that uh, this printer uh, is connected to tax system, and you can scan this uh, barcode or uh, QR code, and uh, it show you your receipt. Uh, 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 directly connect, uh, you can gr grab it directly from a uh, tax system from APIS. Our, our government uh, APIS. What is smart receipts? The smart receipts in Ukraine just uh, appear. Uh, it was a receipt that you uh, got uh, on your mobile phone via push message, via third party application, via Viber, via SMS. Uh, this is smart receipts. In fact, uh, uh, all this uh, three type of uh, receipts, uh, uh, um, they must work like uh, like like, like uh, uh, individual printer. That's why in Python we create uh, some connector, uh, and uh, this connector uh, as uh, standardized uh, to each type of printer, to each manufacturer, uh, etc. Okay, uh, what else we can uh, connect? We can connect uh, scanners. 
uh, scanners like uh, uh, you will see in uh, supermarkets with this uh, laser line. Uh, it could be a laser line, it could be video scanner, uh, image scanner, bar barcode scanner, QR code. Scanner. Uh, it's uh, really a lo lot of, lot of, lot of uh, devices. But uh, big advantage of all of these scanners uh, because they have API libraries, Python libraries, C libraries, C++ libraries. You just connect and that's all. Uh, it's e easy to connect. That's why in uh, Redbox we use Python because Python could be, uh, we could um, change our source code as much as, as we want, as much as possible, as easy as possible and uh, in some cases uh, when I was uh, on uh, hardware installation uh, on other countries and uh, something new appear like uh, clients say oh I want uh, uh, I want new picture I want new background uh, I want a uh, new device. Uh, I just uh, connect new device in a few minutes to equipment using Python. That's why uh, we use this uh, red box. Okay, next slide. Mm, uh, what is black box? Black box, uh, it's a more, more complicated device. Uh, I don't know. Or, oh, it's a light. I don't know. It was such a type of computer. I, I show you uh, on uh, video. Uh, you can look after. <laughs> uh, it was a hardware computer, uh, which was um, uh, divided uh, in different uh, proposals. Uh, first of all, uh, we have networking model. Networking model, it was uh, all networking demons was written by Bash and uh, configured by uh, DevOps. Uh, what was the reason of this uh, magic? Because um, if our device of uh, working standalone mode without the network connectivity, uh, connection between the red box and black box, uh, uh, was provided by uh, LAN cable, and they create uh, their own uh, connectivity using UDP protocol. Uh, and uh, UDP protocol, uh, all APIs in uh, both system was written uh, with uh, support of uh, UDP protocol. Uh, why? Because we don't need no any uh, any coverage, any IP addresses. It's, it's not uh, needed. Also, we can provide a, a routing uh, inside our net networking module uh, uh, using standard Linux firewall. And also, we could connect uh, our system to a uh, retailer network. If our uh, uh, equipment work inside uh, 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 inside retailer market, uh, we must uh, be connected to retailer networking for uh, monitoring, from information, from uh, for cooperation with retailer database, etc. Uh, that's why I uh, draw here networking. Uh, this is one of the bigger, uh, biggest part. And uh, this is uh, a hard, hardware part of computer. And uh, okay, it exists. Okay, what do we have else? Uh, all uh, our uh, system, uh, API system was written by Python using Flask or Falcon uh, uh, framework. Uh, why I... Uh, write Flask and Solcon because it was uh, two different uh, groups of developers and they uh, use uh, similar models and, uh, and create um, different equipment. Uh, it, it was much faster to create a model structure and just uh, port it to any other uh, product uh, which company create. And what we have uh, here in our Flask Falcon system, equipment. First of all, equipment. 
uh, what we connected to equipment scales scales uh, uh, if you want uh, uh, was uh, on a sham supermarket when you scan your product uh, you got message please uh, put your uh, pro product uh, to uh, scale uh, uh, in the left or right side of uh, this device uh, always exists scale uh, to control uh, um, it's like anti-cheater control because in database uh, in each retailer database each product uh, ha having its own weight it could be uh, potatoes or it or it could be electro scooter or it, it could be uh, two space every uh, every product uh, inside the database are uh, scale all scales uh, have, uh, have perfect libraries with C, C++, Python, and we just uh, connect it to our uh, ecosystem. Next, uh, we have Crane, CraneCoin, Glory, GSM. Uh, I uh, drove it. This is a cache uh, recycle system. Uh, these devices uh, are used for uh, take your money and give you cha uh, ch change. Uh, Crane and Crane Coin, uh, this is uh, devices of uh, Crane Co Corporation. Uh, you can uh, see it, um, the devices in uh, in epicenter and uh, yeah, I was first guy who uh, create integration in Ukraine and got certification uh, of uh, manufacturer of these devices, of uh, Crane Corporation. Even uh, guy, uh, even engineers from uh, Italy arrived to Ukraine and uh, uh, take um, exam and take, uh, exam examine my code and make crash control, uh, crash exam. What was funny, uh, they took big, big book for uh, a notice and uh, one of tests was what will be if you punch this device and I start uh, proce start procedure of uh, taking money and punch this device a few times and then look what my program did it. Yeah, he did, uh, he really did it. Other test was what will be if uh, power lost? He really uh, uh, power off device from uh, electricity system. Uh, this is difference between uh, uh, regular uh, devices which you can connect or which uh, work in, in one system or uh, regular or um, uh, in industry grade devices, uh, which created for uh, operated uh, operating with customers because customers could be uh, angry uh, and could punch the device. Uh, customers could uh, use water from bottle to destroy device, etc. That's why. Uh, <laughs> such strange uh, tests and uh, if you write your code on Python or C, C++ in any language, uh, you must uh, uh, remember that uh, sometimes you'll be a strange guy that uh, will make something strange and uh, you must uh, create your co uh, code uh, in, in, in such um, condition. You just must imagine and create this situation. What it? What if? What if? Okay, uh, Crane uh, use its own library, uh, its own uh, USB library. Uh, it uh, has no uh, Python connectivity. The library was written by C, C++. And uh, I spent uh, one year for uh, this integration. What's, what's the problem? Problem was uh, on the beginning, um, uh, no documentation you know, for classical, no documentation. Uh, after a few months, uh, manufacturer sent me documentation, but problem was uh, that uh, half of uh, functions uh, was not working. 
and uh, when engineers uh, come from uh, Italy, uh, this guy have uh, the code of this uh, device or code of library. Uh, he opened it, uh, header files, and noticed that uh, they uh, uh, type boolean. You know what is type boolean. Uh, in effect, type boolean is zero on one, uh, and it uh, took uh, in memory one uh, byte of uh, memory, but I don't know why they use two bytes for Boolean type. Yeah, this was uh, really funny. And after, uh, that, uh, after this knowledge, I just uh, uh, correct my source code and uh, in a half hour, uh, all, uh, all integration was uh, ready and uh, re ready for crash test. Uh, okay, next uh, interesting device, Crane Coin. Uh, this device work using RS uh, uh, protocol, the standard work comport, uh, uh, not, nothing special, but uh, this device use CC talk protocol. Uh, it was uh, interesting for me uh, because uh, I never hear, hear, about, hear about this protocol. And I read this, uh, that uh, this protocol is used and mostly used in any uh, hardware uh, devices, uh, in a lot of devices. Uh, like uh, coffee machines, uh, like uh, terminals uh, for validating your uh, ticket inside Metro, etc., etc. It's uh, a really old protocol and uh, still uh, it's outdated and still really popular. Uh, and this protocol uh, is used to, to uh, in uh, inside in in retail, let's say in retail market and in uh, industrial market. And what interesting, each uh, manufacturer uh, uses this CCTOR protocol as a base uh, uh, protocol, but extend it as, as they want. And when you monitor uh, your uh, communication using uh, Python, uh, it's uh, yeah, it's re really easy to um, uh, make um, communication using this protocol. But uh, I spent some time to understand uh, how it works. Uh, if you want, you can read about CC Talk protocol. It's re really interesting uh, because uh, most startup uh, on market uh, do the same, but they don't know uh, about existing uh, of this protocol. Okay, next. Uh, in market exists a cash management system like Glory. It's really easy to integrate. I spent two hours uh, to integrate uh, cash and coin integration. Two hours uh, integration and uh, Crane one year's integration. Uh, what's, what's easy? Uh, the device connected to you, uh, connect to your equipment using a uh, standard LAN cable, um, net network cable. Uh, it uh, use uh, its own uh, API and you just uh, send uh, post get uh, request using Python. Very easy. You just open document, read about this and a uh, few hours in, uh, and uh, it's uh, ready. But price between Glory and Crane, uh, you just uh, draw zero to price. <laughs> if uh, Crane uh, cash recycle costs three thousand of dollars, uh, Glory cash uh, recycle costs thirty thousand of dollars. Different. Okay, and uh, in the end of uh, money uh, recycles, uh, I will tell you about GCM recycle. Uh, GCM is uh, in effect Fujitsu, Fujitsu Corporation, uh, from uh, oh my, oh, from Japan, uh, Japan, and uh, uh, you can see this money recycles, money receivers uh, in uh, uh, 
everywhere. If you go uh, to buy water in uh, water automatons, uh, this machine, when you put your money, this is uh, GCM, uh, I think in a 90% because uh, it's a, re a really cheap uh, device that working using GRS uh, protocol or USB serial protocol. And it uh, integrates using Python in a few hours. You just uh, send code like uh, uh, receive money, uh, send what uh, a, a regular ASCII line, uh, send money, receive money, and, uh, and that's what. Uh, that's why you difference with, uh, I told you, difference with uh, different uh, equipment. And what we have, other. Other, uh, this is, uh, that could be any equipment that you must connect to your uh, device. Uh, uh, this uh, uh, libraries, anything could be written in any language, could be C, C++, Java, Go, compile it, uncompile it, uh, uh, anything. That's why I, I do it here. here. What else? Uh, interesting inside uh, this box. Uh, we have remote, uh, remote, uh, remote controller. If uh, you need uh, some uh, assistant uh, uh, of manufacturer or, or uh, developer, you must uh, have um, any remote control uh, control without uh, specialist that will came to your uh, machine and press some button. Uh, that's why a uh, remote controller, uh, it's um, a, re a really hard job for uh, DevOps guys. And DevOps guys uh, spend a lot of time for this. And uh, remote control, uh, control, it was in effect uh, uh, Python bash uh, readed services that run on uh, Linux system. And if you need the remove control, they, uh, this system uh, connects to uh, VPN uh, server and you communicate uh, using VPN, using SSH as you, as you want. Also big problem was uh, connection system to retailer. Uh, we created uh, to every retailer, uh, we created its own connector. Uh, and it uh, takes some time. That's why Python, uh, it's re a really useful language for this. Uh, because uh, even if a uh, guy who developed this connector or this model left job, uh, go, go to other company or he on other, uh, project or uh, invocations, uh, any uh, specialist, any Python specialist uh, could uh, fix this problem. Okay. Uh, on this brutal image, uh, I uh, post the real uh, cache machine, self-checkout machine. Uh, this machine, uh, I, I go with this machine to uh, Kuwait, to Kuwait City and spent two weeks uh, with uh, connection, with bank terminal connection, with certification of local authorities. Yeah, it was very interesting. And uh, uh, when uh, cash machine arrived uh, to Kuwait, it uh, looked like uh, in foil, you must remove foil, you must connect, you must uh, check your scales, everything, everything, everything. And all interface, as you uh, could notice it, yeah, using Arabian uh, letters. Yeah, it was hard uh, to me, but uh, I know about uh, what the uh, color of button means. <laughs> okay, uh, other uh, photo, uh, you see EasyPay, uh, you know what is EasyPay. EasyPay is company that uh, take money uh, uh, from uh, this small machine everywhere in the city and you can fill your bank card, you can fill your, uh, uh, what else you can fill, for your phone, etc. 
uh, or even in view uh, using easy pay uh, you can pay money inside uh, electric transport uh, or in uh, ukrainian catholic university easy pay also build a system for uh, discount programs for for students and uh, we work together with this company and build uh, such a device like uh, uh post uh, post maths uh, and now what you, what you can see uh, inside uh, all ukraine nova posta uh, in europe uh, parcel lock uh, or in other, uh, other country a uh, lot of parts of this code that was used in uh, self checkout machines was just ported to uh, the same ported to uh this device and uh, uh, it worked uh, this product uh, was created uh, by th uh, three developers in in one month <laughs> what difference when you can post your modules uh, and post your equipment and just create something new okay i created links uh, yeah uh, it, in mariupol in the uh, Zerkalny market uh, was my device. I will try to open it. Ah, how to open it? Oh. Uh, you can uh, check uh, this link and uh, read the uh, info about these devices. But for now, I think uh, that in Mariupol, uh, everything destroyed and uh, this device that in Ukraine uh, no, uh, no more exists. But this was a photo, a really photo of working devices inside in Ukraine. What else interesting? Uh, now I want to show you how work uh, money recycle. Mm, oh. ah, I, I will, uh, I don't know, will you hear sound or not? But this is a device, how it works. Yeah, it's very loud. It, it, it's uh, uh, I, I uh, told device uh, take some money and device return me money because the device uh, have no money inside recycles. Ah. Uh, no matter, uh, you can see this link, I will copy it. Uh, oh. One moment, I will copy it. One, two. One moment. Oh. Oh. Yeah, you can check uh, chat and in chat I copy link. Uh, on this video, uh, I spent, uh, this was uh, my seventh months of integration of this machine. And uh, uh, I uh, did uh, this task without any documentation, only using uh, Python and uh, uh, bus uh, monitoring programs. I just listened to what was on the bus and uh, created my own program. But uh, what uh, I say that program was really wrong, but machine start start work. Okay, let's return to our presentation. Uh, now I will show you JCM uh, cash dispenser. Oh, have it look, uh, look like a moment. Oh. Sound no matter. This is JCM cash dispenser, uh, and uh, you have a lot of uh, cassettes with money, and you just told the machine give uh, money, and it give you this money. Uh, some some what you did. Also, what interesting in all this machine, uh, uh, when machine work, it also check uh, quality of uh, banknotes. If uh, machine thinks that uh, these banknotes are a uh, banknote are bad, or probably uh, invalid, or 
um, anything else, a machine will uh, store this banknote uh, in, in, in internal box and uh, give you a normal banknote. Uh, yeah, that's why you can uh, be sure that uh, you get your va uh, valid uh, notes. Okay, let's go next. And uh, for the end of uh, this project, I will show you a device in the Hamburg. Uh, my, my device that I did, Ah, here it is. I did it. Python inside. Uh, and uh, uh, UI uh, was written using Angular. Uh, and uh, everything what you see was ported from uh, uh, oh my, from Redbox systems just ported here. Oh, and all modules was supported just uh, to the system and it, it worked. Okay, uh, any, any questions guys uh, for this startup or we move to next one? Any, any, because I must drink my uh, coffee. <laughs> Guys, any question? Okay, let's go to to next one. Luxi, uh, uh, sorry for the interruption. I just want yeah. to mention that uh, we you talk about this startup almost half of our event. So hurry up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, this was uh, probably one of the biggest startup. Perfect. Thank uh, you. Okay, let's let's go uh, uh, to next slide. Uh, I I told you about everything. This we will uh, next. We will uh, move to mushroom picket robot. Yeah, it was a uh, presentation of my previous uh, on my previous uh, tech talk. Uh, you can uh, check it. Uh, there will be more information about this robot. What interesting in this robot? Uh, uh, this robot was uh, built by uh, ROS uh, ecosystem. ROS, it's a robotic OS. Uh, I will uh, uh, paste uh, this presentation to chat after presentation, and you can click this links and check it. Uh, in a few words, uh, ROS, uh, it's like uh, like a, a constructor, like a, a piece of code, piece of li libraries that you can uh, grab together and be, uh, build any robot uh, uh, what you want uh, 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 as fast as possible. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, what about uh, this robot, how this robot was built? Uh, uh, th uh, this robot, uh, uh, some parts of code was written on C, C++, and some part of code was written by Python. And uh, all together, this all uh, parts of code uh, was driven by roles and speaking, uh, speak uh, with each other in real time using a, a topic uh, topic system. Uh, what it is, it's like, um, e e easy imagine, it's like MQTT server. ROS uh, provide lo a layer uh, that look like uh, MQTT and every part of system works with this layer. What was uh, in the architecture of this uh, robot? Uh, on the beginning, we use uh, G-code controller. Uh, uh, G-code, uh, it's a simple uh, ASCII code that you just send uh, using a, a USB uh, serial bus, and that's all. Uh, then it was uh, changed to a drive controller. 
uh, this fully different system and uh, drive controller uh, all uh, use uh, USB or RS or CAN or uh, any other uh, interface to communicate with your equipment. Uh, and it do the same job, but uh, with other uh, drive. Okay, we also use in this project Arduino. For what Arduino? Main purpose of Arduino was uh, just uh, switching, uh, sensor grabbing, uh, and uh, similar protection of our uh, main uh, CPU from any damage uh, that could um, appear in, uh, in, in our world. And video sensor. Video sensor was connected by USB uh, uh, 3 uh, bus uh, for uh, fast, uh, uh, for uh, uh, high bandage. All these devices uh, was connected to RPI. RPI, uh, this is uh, Raspberry Pi 4. We use that. Uh, why 4? Because we need USB uh, 3 uh, ports. Uh, what else? Inside RPI uh, was uh, uh, ROS uh, core, uh, and on the score, uh, like uh, different uh, demons, uh, was uh, uh, working uh, uh, sub processes like uh, written on Python, written on C or C for any purposes uh, that we need. Next one interesting part uh, was uh, Microtic. Microtic it's a uh, level three uh, wireless uh, or oh my wireless router. Uh, main task this wireless router uh, was to communicate with uh, high speed uh, with uh, central networking system on uh, mushroom farm. Uh, and uh, it, it just for uh, a speed up process uh, and stability because uh, a robot work in uh, extremely humidity uh, environment. Uh, that's why no uh, antennas, no uh, 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 no uh, uh, oxidized material and materials could be uh, out of the box. So that's why we use microtic for uh, communication. And human operator. Human operator could be an anywhere on the globe. And human operator just monitor a, a working robot. Uh, he sent command to uh, move out package with mushrooms, uh, uh, monitor uh, state, uh, charging, uh, everything, uh, what, what we need. Uh, next one. Uh, this, uh, how it worked. Uh, the uh, diagram with uh, our ROS system. We have G-code. Uh, G-code was driven by uh, a uh, controller with Atmel based chip. Atmel based chips is uh, the same that they used in Arduino. Uh, inside this Atmel based chip was uh, software using CC and uh, with ROS libraries communicating with uh, USB UR. O drive. O drive, it was a device, a standalone device. Uh, also, it was built on STM uh, microchip, and uh, uh, we modified uh, open source port for, for this the device using C and other uh, ROS, ROS library. Communication was using USB or or CAN, no matter. Wireless controller our uh, also was uh, driving by Python with ROS li library uh, using this wireless controller uh, uh, operator inside farm uh, near robot can uh, stop this robot or restart this robot. This like a uh, mobile uh, user interface. Uh, uh, that's why it was uh, written by Python because uh, we need a lot of uh, fast changes. 
and uh, Arduino, it was also ROS library, C, C++. And uh, this whole uh, system was driven by uh, ARM, uh, ARM8 uh, processor, CPU. And uh, each time when we upload code, uh, we use uh, Docker. But Docker uh, build, building was inside the Docker uh, that was uh, emulate uh, ARM architecture. Because uh, regular Docker, which we use in development, uh, it use uh, x64 architecture or uh, x86 architecture. But uh, if you build your application uh, using this architecture, it uh, never run on uh, ARM device. That, uh, that's why we use uh, this uh, tree. Okay, uh, next one. Ah. Next project. Uh, any question to pre previous project to Mushroom Robot? Okay, uh, if you want, uh, one moment. I, 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 I uh, video on YouTube, uh, I will copy paste to chat. Uh, you can check how this robot work. Up, up, up. Oh, I copy paste it to chat. It, it will be interesting for you uh, how this real product uh, work. Uh, it was prototype uh, and uh, founding we got from uh, Hux Incubator. And uh, probably we spent more than two years on this project. Next interesting project, uh, yeah, I have, uh, have a lot of time. That's why I will be much faster th uh, than in previous project. Okay, it was Sauna. Uh, you know uh, about sauna, but uh, this startup was uh, interesting uh, because it, uh, it uh, idea was to create sauna, relax ecosystem sauna. It means that uh, uh, you can create uh, your music relax list. It, uh, the system will play your music when you inside sauna. It will uh, create uh, a light, uh, uh, light control, li uh, light power, uh, what you want inside this sauna. Also heaters, control heaters, tem temperature, time inside, uh, uh, inside, inside this sauna room. Uh, idea was that the uh, guy just uh, came to sauna, uh, and press uh, here preferences on the screen, and to go to sauna and uh, make fun. Also, this, uh, this device was controlled uh, by your phone. You have account in uh, cloud, uh, etc. What interesting in this pro project? This project uh, was built, uh, yeah, it looked like si uh, simple, but um, uh, product owner uh, have an idea to create an uh, industry grade device. That's why uh, uh, Raspberry Pi uh, create uh, clients say, no Raspberry Pi, no Intel Nuke, no PC, no bullshit. We will order a, a, a device from Torizon. What is Torizon? Uh, or not, uh, not Torizon, but Toradex. What is Toradex? Toradex, uh, this is small company that built uh, uh, your ARM uh, devices for uh, uh, industrial need. It's a, gr a great uh, uh, industrial devices. What interesting is these devices? You just say, I need uh, such, 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 such uh, ports, protocols, uh, uh, equipment, and they assemble this device for you. What interesting is this device? Uh, this device, you, you also can upload their Linux, but they provide their own Linux that called Torizon. Uh, uh, in this Linux, uh, what interesting is they provide, uh, manufacturer provide security, remote access, fault tolerance, fault control, uh, what else, uh, and uh, OTG. 
uh, OTG, this is uh, remove uh, update of your uh, source code, update of your system, everything. That's why clients say, uh, I want uh, this device and uh, this will help me, you, uh, help me to save money if I uh, use the same uh, from uh, AWC. Uh, because AW, uh, AWC, uh, Amazon, takes money for their OTG, uh, for their services, S3, etc. It's uh, very expensive, let's say. Uh, that's why uh, client uh, know what he want. Let's look how, how it works inside. Inside uh, this device, uh, Tourism OS, uh, screen uh, on screen we uh, we will show the UI using React or if it uh, mobile uh, device uh, we, we use uh, source uh, we use uh, Kotlin for mobile device inside uh, our controller Python why Python because it's uh, ready to modify. Uh, we connect a heater uh, using Java connector. Why Java connector? Because uh, manufacturer of heater uh, provide only uh, Java library and that's all. That's why we use uh, Java connector to this uh, library and connect it to Python. Okay, light control sound system. We just write on Python uh, uh, what we need. Uh, uh, communication with AWC. Uh, your preferences on uh, on cloud setting your personal uh, uh, personal space uh, sound system. It's mean your playlist like uh, we, we use uh, what we use uh, YouTube music or uh, Apple music, etc. They just uh, bought a license from. Uh, uh, developer license uh, from streaming uh, service and uh, we uh, we got music di directly from streaming service with, without any uh, problem and uh, what interesting our tourism our system with all uh, source code inside uh, what we write with our, our java Pro, uh, connector with uh, ui with python everything what inside uh, uh, any update we use uh, tourism ecosystem uh, and using uh, otg all source code will be uploaded automatically to all our devices uh, any in any place in the globe uh, that's all on these projects next project uh, open source in startups uh, one guy i say a client uh, work a lot of years in uh, security surveillance uh, industry and uh, he noticed that in that country in that market uh, was no uh, some uh, no uh, some types of sensors and he creates these sensors yeah this guy is a guy this client and his guys was really cool engineers in sensors but uh, they have no money for uh, for building whole ecosystem uh, that's why um, they chose to use uh, open hub open hub uh, this is um, uh, linux based python system uh, you can download it and upload to your uh, raspberry pi uh, Raspberry Pi live inside your uh, home network, uh, and uh, you uh, connect any IoT uh, device uh, to this hub. And from your PC or mobile application, you could uh, add uh, these IoT devices to uh, your uh, home uh, smart home network. What uh, want client? He want to take this open hub project, uh, uh, reconfigure it fully to only, to only support his devices and uh, fully re uh, redraw UI uh, to create a device 
for his products, only for his products. These devices, uh, the sensors, uh, must uh, uh, in future will be installed uh, in uh, sci, uh, in uh, security facilities, uh, inside buildings, uh, everywhere. And uh, this sensor is not for regular user needs. It's only for security purposes. That's why uh, clients say we will modi modificate this. Uh, Open Hub written by Python. And uh, why not? Uh, OK, we could uh, rebuild and create uh, what our client wants. Next, our client, uh, second problem, our client uh, uh, wants to create uh, some um, uh, management system for all these hubs for clients, for monitoring, for uh, billing, purchasing, uh, everything. Uh, also, he was uh, he had a lot of money uh, for this uh, purpose. That's why uh, idea was use Odoo. I think, uh, uh, guys, you know what is Odoo. Odoo is a CRM system with a lot of additional models, uh, and uh, it's uh, open source and uh, written by Python, mostly by Python. Okay. But uh, how to connect this to different systems? Okay, with Odoo, no problem. With the device, no problem. Problem was how to connect it together. And uh, uh, our solution was create an QTT server. Just uh, run somewhere uh, in the cloud and QTT server. And uh, each open hub device will send MQTT, uh, data to MQTT server. Uh, Odoo grabs this data from uh, MQTT server, uh, manipulate it, and uh, MQTT server was uh, like a layer uh, between communication. Main purpose of this system, every open hub, uh, every sensor must be online uh, every time. Few seconds uh, missing of devices is a crit critical situation. Uh, that's why we use MQTT, Open Hub, Odoo, and uh, grab it all together. Uh, overall, uh, clients spent, uh, as far as I remember, fifty thousand or hundred thousand of dollars for for all ecosystem. And uh, most, um, uh, monthly cost uh, hundred dollars, and it's easy, cheap uh, was cheap to uh, use open source and not right uh, right to uh, from the beginning. And what we have C C plus plus on sensors, uh, Open Hub on Python, EODU on Python, <laughs> easy. Next one, smart coffee machine. Yeah, this photo of my coffee machine, my coffee machine, not smart, but I think about it, how to fix it. Uh, this was project uh, that um, was uh, create, uh, uh, created in Singapore. And the uh, idea was uh, to make money selling coffee, not selling uh, coffee machine, but selling coffee. Uh, and uh, how to sell coffee better? They have an idea. Okay, let's create coffee machine. But uh, there are a lot of coffee machine on the market. And uh, let's create coffee machine that uh, could be connected to your uh, shop account. And you can uh, create your own receipts for, uh, for your coffee. Uh, for uh, different rosters of this coffee, for different temperatures, uh, any coffee magic, what you want. They create this machine uh, and uh, our task was uh, to make it better because uh, all this infrastructure uh, was created by guys from India. Uh, yeah, it's really funny uh, and uh, after India developers uh, and in, uh, it was a really, really hard job how to fix all this and make it uh, look like pro product and how to expand this product to global market. Okay, next, uh, how it worked. 
it was coffee machine. Uh, Indian guys uh, used in this coffee machine two uh, different microcontrollers. One microcontroller was on STM32, not, nothing special, but uh, they use uh, operation system free RTOS. You can uh, also check it uh, after the presentation what it is. This uh, re real time operation system for microcontrollers. Uh, also, all code was written by uh, CC++ in this uh, microcontroller. UI uh, was uh, built by using ESP32 microcontroller. And in fact, it was just uh, button, lights, uh, uh, USB, Bluetooth, uh, wireless, and nothing else. Main purpose of this controller was uh, OTG communication with uh, cloud, uh, etc. Uh, how it uh, work connection? If you uh, chose your Bluetooth model, uh, Bluetooth connect to your mobile device, mobile device connect to your uh, uh, personal account, uh, and you can start browsing uh, from uh, uh, from your mobile device. Uh, nothing special. Uh, just uh, on the mobile application, you can get uh, additional uh, information uh, about clinic machine, additional uh, information uh, to buy new coffee, uh, uh, advertisement of uh, different rosters, uh, anything what you want. Uh, uh, on mobile device, uh, we use, uh, as far as I remember, also Kotlin. Uh, okay, uh, wireless. Uh, wireless connection we connect to AWC, and uh, marketplace was also uh, on AWC infrastructure, and uh, mm, uh, uh, all infrastructure was built using Docker's uh, containers, and each in each inside Docker containers uh, was source code built by Python. Uh, some Docker containers, uh, it was just uh, Lambda functions minimal. Some Docker containers, uh, it was uh, uh, on, uh, almost uh, all project was on Lambdas, uh, Python and Lambdas, but only Marketplace was uh, written uh, using framework. And idea was uh, to uh, advertise uh, coffee to client uh, and uh, all, all this startup uh, got money only by uh, selling coffee. Uh, that's why coffee machine uh, was so, uh, sold by uh, price of equip equipment, nothing else. Uh, the same uh, as Pfizer, as, as I remember, did Sony on PlayStation. Uh, you can correct me. Uh, or, or, or other console companies, they uh, sold the console just for uh, its uh, real price, but they got money for uh, games. Uh, this small st startup, and uh, I spent a lot of time uh, on AWS uh, infrastructure to uh, even if uh, we look uh, for expansion to uh, global market, uh, how to find uh, a perfect location of ser uh, servers uh, for uh, for everything. Yeah, it was also really hard uh, job. Also, uh, what is the interesting with free RTOS uh, RTOS system? It provides you uh, integrated OTG system. You just uh, uh, add the library with uh, OTG, and this library will connect to AWC OTG, uh, and uh, you can update uh, your source code. But um, when I look at the uh, source code of this copy machine, I laughing because um, some libraries was copied from uh, Arduino CC. Uh, the uh, website and uh, e e even with commands uh, from original library, it was funny. Okay, next project. Uh, yeah, uh, this project was built uh, to Saudi Arabia and Emirates uh, uh, region. 
uh, what was mail, uh, main idea? Uh, we have drone, but in local laws in these countries, uh, for uh, flying with drone, you must have a license from local authorities, from uh, uh, air forces, a lot of uh, license. Uh, this startup uh, have an idea to create controller that you attach to your drone, and this uh, and uh, you provide uh, a map and say I will fly in this map. And this uh, startup controller monitor when where you uh, flying, and uh, send uh, information directly in real time to uh, authorities. And authorities, uh, in uh, if any problem, uh, could uh, block your uh, drone or even destroy. It. As I uh, know, uh, in the evening uh, or in the uh, end of project, they just attach a small piece of explosive because they calculate uh, and think how they will try to find uh, this drone uh, uh, somewhere in the field in the, in the uh, anywhere uh, it's uh, cheaper and easy to, uh, to destroy a drone if uh, it uh, fly uh, out uh, out the range uh, first prototype was built by simple simple raspberry pi simple cheapest raspberry pi all source code was written by Python. Uh, uh, for networking, uh, we use standard uh, Linux networking uh, uh, PPP or yeah uh, demo. Yeah, it's still inside uh, Linux, but uh, mostly type uh, time is uh, unused. Okay, uh, GPS model uh, 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 for communication with uh, satellites for GPS, GLONASS, Galileo, uh, uh, Baidu uh, was attached directly to RPI. LTE model uh, also to RPI attached. Battery model, uh, uh, we have uh, real time log to notice that, uh, how uh, many times we left for flying and switching system is just just switch uh, uh, you can attach to the switch anything in the beginning it was just uh, bulb uh, but uh, guys from uh, Saudi uh, uh, attach their uh, uh, small piece of explosive uh, all this uh, system was uh, uh, was speaking with uh, uh, source code uh, with main system using MQTT protocol, MQTT server, uh, and then connect to Azure. On Azure uh, uh, was uh, uh, application that was written by C Sharp and uh, UI on Angular. Uh, why C Sharp and Angular? Because uh, on the beginning, uh, this project was started by uh, guys from uh, from Italy, yeah, and they just uh, they did this project re really really slow and have no any expertise uh, in uh, hard hardware. That's why uh, everything. Uh, my, my team uh, finished this project, finished c -sharp application, Angular application, and connected to, together. On this photo, what you see, uh, this is just prototype. Uh, because in uh, product grade, it was a really small chip, uh, like, uh, like, like USB stick. So it was really, really, really small. But on the like prototype, uh, I spent forty dollars for this prototype. As as prototyping, it's a, a really cheap. And in the in the end, I want to show you Lviv's success startup that uh, alive that got a lot of money. Uh, this startup uh, has named Somadi. 
or go somatic, you can check on the internet. Uh, why I want to tell you about this project? Because I saw a lot of uh, news inside Telegram, Facebook, uh, that uh, China guys create robots that clean uh, rooms, toilets, uh, uh, etc. But in effect, uh, this robot was built in Lviv. And uh, I was a consultant uh, in uh, this company, uh, just free consultant, and I give, uh, give them idea uh, uh, and even help them with uh, hardware uh, specialists. Uh, uh, and uh, this robot was created. Uh, what inside the robot? Inside the robot, uh, uh, it's Python, C, C++ uh, uh, program. In hardware, it's uh, NVIDIA CUDA and artif uh, artificial intellect. This robot is fully autonomous uh, and uh, it used already in the United States in uh, a, lo a lot of companies. Uh, because it's work uh, fully autonomous and work in night. And it uh, help uh, to save a lot of money uh, and uh, do uh, this job uh, as efficient as possible. Uh, in my presentation, I uh, create some uh, links. Uh, you can check it, but let's look the last video on uh, on the site somatic and how it worked everything was written by python uh, robo arm very popular uh, the uh, things this white robo arm now robot will open the door Yeah, yeah, it uh, opens the door slowly, but uh, it clean the uh, uh, room really fast. This is like Xiaomi, but really huge Xiaomi. <laughs> and all control without human, it's fully automatic. Clean, clean, clean. What interesting, in the beginning uh, of this project, uh, guys use uh, Raspberry Pi for controls. Uh, in next generation of robots, they use uh, uh, already uh, Jetson uh, devices with integrated CUDA, but uh, they have problem with uh, energy because uh, when uh, every electron motors uh, work, it uh, create extremely high noise on uh, uh, on um, program level, and uh, that's why. Uh, uh, uh my guys my friends create uh, for for this startup uh is a personal computer no not personal computer uh motherboard uh, these connected uh, video cards uh, for uh, for CUDA that's all uh yeah. sorry I, I have a question you mentioned that you updated the code using aws otg but i can't find such a service maybe you mean ota it's it means over the air or could you please provide a link for the service otg uh, this is uh, on aws you can write here uh i can uh, try to find you about uh, otg on uh, uh, on uh, AWS. This is your question because I I, I will try to make. Oh. Yes. Uh, I, AWS uh, have uh, OTG uh, service. But in in one startup, uh, I noticed that uh, one startup did OTG using uh, S3 uh, endpoint. 
it was stupid, but uh, but it works. But uh, uh, AWS have OTG. I, I I must check on Google. <laughs> Could you please provide a link for this? Because I googled AWS OTG and uh, the only one result it's about Intel Olympic Technology Group, and uh, it doesn't look like uh, what you means. Okay, okay, okay. I, I, I will check. I will check. This project okay. was was built year a year ago, uh, and I hope that uh, OTG survives still online. Uh, but I, I I will check. I will check. Uh, you can write me uh, directly in uh, Teams, and I, okay. I, I will check. Okay. Thank you.